My fiance Joel has been hiding something from me and I actually found out because I went through his messages yesterday. In all honesty, I didn't go through them. We actually have each other's Instagram accounts logged into our phones and it just popped up. When I confronted him, he told me it was a surprise, but I know for a sheer fact it was because he knew I would be flipping angry. But we went and picked it up an hour ago and... Oh. I want to be angry, I but I can't. I just can't. Backstory, the reason why I didn't want any more puppies is we have our two Frenchies at the moment. And you guys will see we don't show them too much on my YouTube channel, just in the sense where we're still living in our rental before we move into our property. And we try to minimize the amount of time our pets are inside, just in respect of the owner of this rental. But when they are inside, French Bulldogs aren't clean. I think London, I really, I like it, London. London, London. As you guys would have seen, we obviously have our three Frenchies and then one of them is currently pregnant. Having a pregnant dog in general is very stressful. And when we are outside of the house, we actually have like a little baby camera on her. And we're actually going to look at a few warehouses, which is super exciting. So it'll kind of be like a content slash podcast kind of it all but joel and i are in the works of a project and we will actually need it for the project joel and i are shooting for the this weekend um and yeah. we are able to one set of dumbbells and we could do everything with that one set what are those can't take your business seriously honey oh, nice. i'd be stoked if they left that here I like how it's got big ceilings though. I am so glad this has arrived today. We literally have the busiest day. This morning, Joel and I are heading to um, a really exciting shoot, and then this afternoon, we are going to the vet. Um, we like to order meal prep foods, especially from You Foods, every now and again, just to switch it up from our normal cooking and we love you foods because we find with a lot of other meal prep companies um, they don't fill us up like you foods do whoa the unboxing we've had you foods many times and we do love them their meals are super balanced which i love um and on their website they do offer like a meal plan for um vegetarians like they have so many options on their website i just got a full balanced one um and most meals have around 30 grams of protein which is really good and as well the ingredients so like not only are their macros super friendly but they're also really focused on micronutrients so Pack full of veggies and all the good stuff and that is something that I definitely look for in a meal prep company um, is their ingredient list because my gut does love more simple ingredients um, but also another reason why I do incorporate um, meal prep companies especially like you foods is because my gut also loves variety so we tend to stick to the same foods um, when we're cooking at home and when I'm incorporating new foods, I'm eating all these different foods that we probably just wouldn't normally have, like things like beef lasagna. I don't know how to cook that, especially with 30 grams of protein. Um, and yeah, there is such a wide variety and their foods are honestly so delicious. Oodly noodlies. <laughs> we got some oodly, we got some oodly it's noodlies. Where did you get that from? Spaghetti bowl. So we got some spag bowl. Chicken parmesan. Um, and this one's with like peas and cauliflower and chicken katsu. I love chicken katsu. You guys would have seen you foods literally everywhere. I do have my own code for you food, so it is Christy U. I will put it on the screen, everything in the description below. And that actually gives you $200 off over the period of your first five orders. Um, like I said, everything will be in the description. We have to get ready for the day. I'm stressed when I know I've got a lot on. Same. <sighs> Very stressed. <sighs> it's gonna be a good day. So we are 
are currently doing some filming for have it all set up but the reality of today is we're actually really stressing because we've got the dogs at home and harley is literally due to give birth today so it's all perfect timing so we have them like on our monitor on our phone and we're just stressing and we're trying to get this out as quick as possible um i can't do rose with that one all right like this i usually put my head here like that and it's really hot at least it looks like a natural glow of sweat Oh, that's better. And I got a poo. I swear to God, I do. Ben over rose a lot heavier than this. But just for like filming purposes, we go quite light, so each rep is sucking. Honestly, when I'm booking studios, the main thing that I look for is that they have a toilet and a kitchen, because I'm just gonna heat up some lunch, especially when you're filming a workout. You're literally work, like it's harder than an actual workout. You have to do so many reps and sets. This one is just the U Foods steak and chips. 32 grams of protein. I know, okay. Yeah. Okay, well we don't need that. Let's get it away. Oh my God. So we're watching Harley from our phones because we have like cameras and we did ring our vet whilst we were there just kind of telling him her symptoms at the moment and she's like huffing and puffing is this normal and he basically said no so we're getting her cesarean done today we did film a majority of what we needed to film and what we're launching it will be happening in kind of like sets of like programs this is probably like really exposing ourselves here but it'll be done in like program. So we've been able to film the first lot of program. Because we had to rush out, I didn't have time to eat. So I'm just having the steak and the chips now. Y'all gonna get a little love taste test. Oh, yeah, that's so good. I'm also having my newest obsession with it, 20 quarter. So today is the day this little girl is going to have a puppies we've set up a whelping box. Her to get comfy in and we've got a little incubator that our friends gave us. Actually where we got little fluff ball from. Yeah, so it's going to be an eventful couple of days and I'm pretty sure I'm going to sleep right there. Where are you going to sleep? Comfortably in my bed. We've been informed by all our friends literally how not sleep you get. How not sleep. <laughs> but honestly, because we have a few friends with Frenchies and, and they've got puppies, so with a lot of them, they're just up crying, they need feeding every two hours. This is good practice for when we have babies. Well, Baba. Except like, it's a baby, Ooh. not a puppy. Yeah, so wish us luck. We're about to head to the vet in about 10 minutes and then show you some puppies. Uh, okay, right? wait, I think. I can't see us. He's still new at this. That oh. We can flip it, babe. Okay, I think we're gonna have six. Well, our lucky number is seven, but I reckon there's at least five, maybe more. I said six, like safe. I feel like seven's dramatic. I feel like that's a lot. Six, I'm manifesting that. Okay, wish us luck. See you with no sleep in four see days. You. I will see you in like an hour. <laughs> You're like a dad and his first child's about to be born. You're so stressed. <laughs> oh, Where are they? Watch the clock ticking off the wall. But tonight I'm letting it go. Spend my coin for sure. Give her a gonna be my son. Or be someone else. No one's stopping me now. I'm gonna skip my breaks. Gonna make mistakes. I just wanna feel alive. I have envisioned this shelf that I'm gonna put all the dog stuff in, then I'm gonna put a nice mirror on top. And I was looking online this morning and it says there's this new one at Kmart and I have to get it. And I am hoping to God it's in stock at the Kmart near up. Do you get awkward when I vlog in public? <laughs> You're in fucking element, mate. I am. I love this place. Well, what are you looking for? Um, labels. Snacks. They're the wrong ones. Or them little ones. I have that. I'm gonna get. Well, how do you get them when you don't have a cabinet? Because regardless, I'm gonna get one. Joel left the camera, so I'm filming on my phone somewhere, and 
he, he thinks he's lost it. And a couple just come up and told me that they found it and they put it behind the desk and he's freaking out and I'm just gonna play it out. I'm, I'm gonna pretend he's freaking out. So you lost it? <laughs> Fuck, I thought so. that egg was right. No, this couple told me. Yum, I've got Joel hooked on the ice lattes. We're like best friends. Kmart and latte dates with my bestie. Although what I originally wanted wasn't in stock at Kmart, I did pick up this bargain from Basil Market that afternoon. I'm planning to DIY it, so I did get a few things from Kmart. This is the space that we have all the dog stuff in at the moment, and it's causing me so much stress. It's absolutely chaotic, so I'm excited to do all of this up and then organize all the puppies. Leads, blankets, toys, and everything in the drawers. Although I do like this coastal theme with the wood, it doesn't actually tie in with the rest of my furniture in the house. So I was originally planning to put these pink tiles on top but they didn't actually work how I wanted them to. As you can see you can't see the entire tile at the front and sides and that was the whole point of it. So I am planning to just completely do it all white. the handles I did take them to Bunnings to get the size match but Bunnings actually didn't have the size that we needed so we had to drill in some extra holes for my new handles. Okay, I'm, okay look I can't see because your hands are there. How do you expect me to know where the middle is from air? From air? Well I couldn't see shit. After three coats of paint it was finally dry that morning and then I styled it up. I chose to style it with some beiges, some pinks, some blues to actually add some colour in there because it is a lot of white and eventually I do want to add like a mirror or something on top but we're still in our rental so I'll have to wait till we're in our new property. These paintings are so beautiful. My mother-in-law painted them for me so I'll probably hang them on top. Anyway guys, I hope you did like this little DIY. But before I go, I wanted to give a big shout out to the sponsors of today's video. So Squarespace. Squarespace is an all-in-one website builder. I've been using Squarespace for literally years and I originally chose Squarespace when I first started out because it is honestly so easy to build your own website and when I first started my online career I did not have the money to be forking out thousands on a website designer and I was able to do that all on my own at the start of my online career and I still use Squarespace and I still make my own websites with Squarespace because it's honestly so easy to use. Squarespace offers great admin tools like being able to look at your analytics, mailing campaigns, anything that you basically need to run a successful online business, Squarespace offers it, hence the all-in-one website builder. It is honestly incredible. Guys, I literally recommend Squarespace to anyone who is just starting out with their online business or wanting a landing page, a blog page, a website. I do have my discount code that gives you 10% off your first domain or Squarespace purchase and I will leave everything in the description below. Anyway guys, I'll see you in my next video. Bye!